North Korea fired what is presumed to be Musudan, a mid-range ballistic missile, but it fell just a few seconds after launch. This comes just weeks after another similar failure. Kim Young bin starts us off. North Korea has fired off yet another projectile, but it crashed just seconds later. A senior South Korean military official said Thursday the object was fired at 6.40 a.m. from a mobile launch pad in Wonsan on the northeast coast. The projectile is presumed to be a mid-range Mustang ballistic missile, the same kind as the one the North fired on April 15th. That one also exploded in mid-air seconds after liftoff. The official said North Korea had dispatched two Mustang missiles for the launch earlier this month, and that the missile fired this time had been on reserve since then. He said the South Korean and U.S. military are conducting a detailed assessment of the matter. Experts believe that North Korea will continue to test the Mustang missile until it conducts a successful launch. North Korea seems to have launched the missile in redemption of its previous failed launch, but there seems to be several fundamental problems as there were no test launches. We expect the North to conduct more tests in the near future to fix the problems. The Mustang missiles were dispatched for the first time in 2007 without going through any test launches. Until Pyongyang conducted his first test on the birthday of the regime's founder, Kim Il sung, which fell on April 15th. Kim Young bin Arian News. And we are just receiving updates that the regime fired another Musadan missile following that launch on the same day in the afternoon. The later attempt, on dis um, attempt to display its military might end it with a mid-air explosion. While the successful launch would have added to the celebratory mood for Pyongyang with many big events lined up, experts say the failures instead exposed the regime's current missile system is seriously flawed.